it was called in by some good Samaritans that knew exactly what it was. They were worried about it, of course. I mean, just frostbite alone would be enough to push this animal uh, over the edge. Um, but he had no frostbite, which is really one of those mysteries. But they were concerned just because of the way he looked. They weren't sure whether he could have Dermadex or mange or, you know, maybe carrying something that could be uh, contagious. We don't feel that that's the case. It doesn't look like she's carrying any parasites. She looks really healthy, just lacking hair. <laughs> he could be described as a bit feisty, but that's only to be expected, as most of our wild patients are. But he's nervous. He's really scared. I think he's been through a lot. I may apply uh, and ask permission from DNRNR and see if they might possibly let him live out his time here. We'll keep our fingers crossed and uh, we'll ask permission when we figure out what exactly is wrong. He may, under good supervision and good diet, he may grow back some of his fur and he may be releasable.